hello 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 my love bugs once again it is your girl let me love here with another message from the divine y'all this one here i don't know where we're going <laughs> all i can say is uh thank you guys for your likes subscribe shares uh, uh, views and memberships and all that there it's very like greatly appreciated let's get into this because this is throwing me off i didn't think i was gonna pick up on this energy someone is petitioning themselves as a whore and the part that's kind of throwing me is I think they're trying to do that to you. And I know this is a feminine energy. It's a feminine energy that's trying to make you want her, bro. <laughs> it's a feminine energy that's trying to make you want her. Oh, because she want to be in a threesome. So we got a woman who is petitioning herself, trying to sell herself to your masculine because she feels betrayed that he don't want to deal with her no more. And she like, why not? I think the bitch you going for, she cute and stuff. I sleep with her too. This woman ain't even supposed to know who the hell you are. And somebody didn't show her your picture or somebody that introduced your energy to her and she feel upset. She like, okay, I see why he want to go over there with her. But I'm saying like, I come over there too. He already know what type of time I'm on. Like, what is, what's the problem? Y'all, I don't think it's your divine masculine. <laughs> I think this is somebody else who wants to come in and they want to come to you and they're going to leave whoever they with to come. Oh my gosh, you make me want to leave the one I'm with and start a new relationship with you. This is what you do. Think about it on my things. Come on with you. Make me, you make me. Okay. Ooh, baby. Oh, baby. This is somebody you went to dancing with because I went to jamming. This is some. I don't know. This might be a singing ass. I don't know. This person might be in that energy now because they want to deal with you. I don't think this is a singing energy. Maybe this is a singing energy. Maybe this masculine can sing. Uh, all I know is this masculine possibly was with you in the past. They've been looking at you in secret. The woman was upset and she found out. And she was like, I mean, damn, he let me sleep with everybody else. Why he don't want me to sleep with her too? So you leaving me? Oh, my God. <laughs> Y'all, what? So you leaving me because you want to be with her? But I like girls, too. I like her, too. Why I can't be with y'all? So she like, well, shoot. Maybe if I go over there and I try to be her little friend or get her to be cool with me first, then, you know, he won't have no... She a crazy, a crazy ex or something, right? And she feel like if she can be your friend or come in to be your friend and then he pop up on you, she'll be there like, ta-da. See, look, I told you this would be perfect. Y'all, I don't think she got good sense in her head. I ain't go to talking like no damn bird brain dicks ago till I got on here talking about this girl. I really think, I really, yes, he overpowered her. He really got her mind gone. But, I mean, it's easy because I don't think she has her own mind. She doesn't know her own, her own self. And she just let this man take control of her and be with her. And that's why she was in third parties. And that's why she sleep with women because she don't really care, you know. Long as she get a little change and she can look good, she good with it. Like, it's whatever. But now she feel like she about to lose her spot. So, her crazy kicking in because she like, no, I'm begging you. Like, just... I like just introduce her to me. I promise you she'll like me. Like, whoa. <laughs> and I think the masculine kind of heavy burden because he like, I really didn't want to like still deal with you. I really just wanted to go over here and deal with her. I mean, I wouldn't mind having you on the side, but I done been with her before and I really don't think she gonna deal with a feminine. And the girl's like, no, like I know exactly what to do to get her to want me. Like I always know what to do to get somebody to want me. Like just give me a chance. And the dude was like, uh, why? She was like, because I did it to somebody in the past, didn't it? Okay, to be honest, she was saying to herself, she did it to his ass. She did it to other people in the past. But I think that that's the way they ended up in some threesome another time was because this woman tried to come towards you, be your friend, give you something in a drink, maybe invite you to come travel far away to come see her. She humbled herself in front of this masculine, but this woman crazy. Did she, she, this bitch a dingbat, y'all. She act stupid. This bitch psycho. She like, she stupid, but she ain't stupid. You feel me? Like, she ain't ditzy, but she, she'll get dumb. Like, she'll go crazy. That's what I'm getting off this dumb, stupid, crazy. Like, this girl goes, she goes, <laughs> she goes psycho, bro. She goes psycho when she don't get her fucking way or she goes psycho. Like, she try to play that real innocent role and next thing you know, she's spazzing out. For some of y'all, she could be a Scorpio. Listen, bro. All I know is this woman's very upset that this man's gonna wanted to drop her to come and take an opportunity with you because any other feminine he slept with, she was able to sleep with too and she was able to benefit because she was able to get what she wanted from a girl and from a dude. Okay, she wanted to get you hung up in a situation. She wanted you to open a cycle with her, let her in to be your friend and then she wanted to give you some shit or try to seduce you in some sort of way because she had a lot of passion for you. Maybe she tried a bunch of love spells while she was around you trying to be your friend and that shit did not work. I really feel like this woman came towards you for some of y'all but others she 
she's getting ready or she wanted to get ready to come towards you. She's getting ready because this masculine want to come towards you and he's possibly married to her. So she like, well, you have no choice but to let me tag along because I'm married to you and I allow you to do these things, but I only allow you if you want me to partake and you don't want me to partake and I think that's real fucked up and I'm not going to let you just live without it. Yeah, I don't know why I'm talking like this. I really feel like this lady got a very calm voice. People, I, I'm, I'm hearing, <laughs> I'm thinking about Nicki Minaj for some reason in a lot of pink um what it is I ain't gang if you let shit slide some some if you like dick ride uh something don't stop don't stop the beat uh what she said something about body some some got no body but maybe she might be smiling to you maybe she mad because you got body she think that's why that mask don't want to be with you maybe you got body and that's why she's attracted to you and she wish that mask didn't want to be with you but she mad she ain't got nobody nobody what's going on with this body damn she might not have nobody because people holding their guard up to her because of the shit that she did to get with this mask man or because she's with this mask man why what she got what she got oh my god she got a track record she got a track record of getting what she wanted but she can't get her way with you and that's what's upsetting her and she feel like she upset that this man want to come towards you and leave her behind. But she real mad because her stuff not working on you. And you won't let her, like, seduce you. Because she want to. And, like, it's worse. Because her love spells is backfiring. And she doing them bitches a lot. <laughs> so it's like, she's building passion. This is, this is, she's building passion. Okay? But some of y'all, y'all don't uh mind being with a woman some of y'all could be bisexual you just don't do threesomes <laughs> you know put yourself where you go that's what i just got from this some of y'all don't mind the different options some of y'all like to you know sleep with other people with different um orientations yes i'm learning y'all <laughs> different orientations or whatever so you know you don't mind even if it was like damn i really feel like she feel some sort of way and conflicted as well because she feel like you know, even if you did like women, you don't like his thinking ass, so you wouldn't allow, I don't know, this woman that got into it because she don't want to be left behind. Maybe she ain't got nobody and this man was the only one giving her money and shit. She feel like if he goes somewhere, then he gonna hold you on the pedestal and not her and she gonna be tore up because now she can't sleep with him, anybody else, or you. And she wanted to cause ruin for you and jealousy for you. Oh, she know you don't want to sleep with this man because he got that shit. I think he, he got something. Oh, yes, Lord have mercy. He got something. He got something. And the reason she's attached to him is because he gave it to her. And now people got their guard up to her. Why she, and he planning on trying to come towards you. So she made her plans to try to come towards you in the secret. But these love spells she doing ain't fucking working. Because you're a star seed. And she's being held up from a victory. What victory she wanted? For everybody to like her, she wanted your energy. Okay, so she really wanted to sleep with you too because she wanted your energy. I really feel like her and this masculine used to talk about how your energy would give him a boost. Um, For some of y'all, this was somebody that he could have been sleeping with on the side when he was sleeping with you. And this bitch had a taste of your energy. I heard a taste of your medicine. Now she's getting a taste of her own medicine. She feel like a fool because she possibly tried to take this masculine or she was just dealing with this masculine outside of you. Like I said, she don't care who she sleep with. She don't mind threesome. She like to get it in. That's her job, okay? So she's a whore. That's what she do. This masculine could have been pimping her out at some point. He felt like, well, if you don't mind sleeping with everybody and it's all good, then I can go ahead and charge. I can go ahead and y'all I don't why I don't know. I can go ahead and charge uh you know why she sleep with other people, get money out of folks and then give her a little bit of change to make her feel good. That was their relationship together. Pimp and hoe. And he was she was mad because the pimp was finna lead a hoe. She feel like a fool cause all the magic that she did ain't working. All the options that she been given to be number one to this masculine ain't working. She worked very hard to send a message. Oh, she, oh, that's fucked up. She worked very hard with this masculine, for this masculine, and just to send a message, you know, to have him look at her in a higher light, like make her his number one, and she didn't want to do that. She wanted to be the number one. She wanted to get pregnant. She wanted to have a family. She didn't want to hold no more. Oh, man, I'm here. She don't want to be a freak no more. She don't want to be a freak no more. She don't want to be freaking no more. <laughs> 
it's not funny she don't she don't in secret she think that this man gonna try to come and get you pregnant and then she's gonna feel betrayed that's why she feels like she needs to be in the in the group she want to be a wife i thought she was a wife oh that's what he telling her this is probably somebody who's been engaged for a minute i don't know why we here though okay because she gonna come try to tell you some sort of truth and secret that she possibly had got pregnant by this man when y'all was together and don't let him come back around because he's just trying to start some shit and then oh i did a reading on this before and then she gonna sit there and talk to you and try to be your friend and then eat your cat i'm telling you she gonna try to come up with some sort of plan feel sorry for me because he gave me this std and you know i i just found out about you because he been like you know trying to stalk you and, and, and come to you and do all kind of stuff and you know i just want to hurry up and let you know that this masculine you know he's very obsessive he be out here drinking sleeping with a lot of different people when he was with you he even slept with me girl i even got pregnant i lost the baby he just you know what i'm saying and he been you know chasing me and he won't let me live and he trying to come over here back and party with you and i just wanted to let you know that girl you don't need to deal with that this man just trying to come over here and control you he done did all this and that and the third you know I and, and I don't know she just want to tell you a whole bunch of stuff and she want to see if you get upset so then she can be like well, we could be friends you know and then try to work it in some sort of way to make you a threesome to make y'all a one big ass family because this woman feel like she's going to be begging for finances or at least customers if she's not with this masculine she's also jealous because she feel like why don't you find me attractive like everybody else in the world find me attractive everybody want me to I guess she good at what she do when she do what she do, right? And so she just felt like she'll definitely have success with you. She'll definitely make you uh she'll definitely make you come a bunch of times. She don't even know what the problem is. Like she really feel like <laughs> this is crazy because she just wanna come to you and be like, I mean, just let me try this shit. If you don't like it, then I'll leave. Y'all, why are we here, bro? She really do. She just wanna get with you, bro. You not with that shit though. You not with that shit. You out here getting the bag away from this masculine. That's another thing that possibly got this masculine jealous and that make him want to come in towards you because he feel like you making money out. Oh, who is this obsessive ass energy? He feel like you making money outside of his 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 eyesight, outside of what he say you can have. Who is this psycho? This is somebody who's very obsessed over you. This person don't have shit to do with you. But this person's mentally trapped over you because you're getting a victory outside of being with them. And they ain't got no choice but to sit over here and pimp hoes. And now they main hoe who they been pimping want to come towards you and mess it up. But he want to play in your face and get some money out of your pocket. See, he pole hustling. Yeah, he pole hustling. <sighs> we got to read about a pole hustler. Why do I like these cards out here? It's something about your body. <laughs> body. Yeah, man, this woman feels very, she feel like you should be attracted to her. And why in the fuck can she not trick you? You'll be perfect. You got the perfect energy. You cute. She'll love to lay in the bed with you. She want to stick her face on her stuff. What's, why? Why, y'all? This for some of y'all. That's why she want to come see this message. All right. So we, we got the background on what these people want and what's going on. What's the, what's the, what's the scoop? What's the real... What's the real deal is what I'm hearing. Oh, because this King of Wands got that shit and they want to come give it to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's two people out here who trying to make their way back towards you to come give you that shit. And you're not going to go toward these people, I know for sure. But there's some sort of slander, some sort of lie that you got to know about. Oh, this woman might be obsessed, I heard, because... She wants to really have a baby. And this masculine keeps saying he want to go back to you because of this baby. Burn after reading. Some sort of evidence they got to get rid of. I feel like he told her that you got pregnant. Maybe this that man, your ex that was going around lying and telling people he had got you pregnant and you lost the baby. For some of y'all, this might be an ex that actually got you pregnant. Hold on, let me get this card. Yeah, and this person is stalking you. Maybe they're trying to get rid of the evidence of stalking you. Maybe get rid of the evidence in there. Didn't I say somebody trying to slander you in some sort of way? Lie on you? Monitoring spirits? Somebody want to try to say you're stalking them? He don't want you to know that he was stalking you because then you're not going to accept him whoa this this got dark quick okay boom 
So this woman over here acting like you is just a lot of her life that she need to get a part of you. She want to team up with you now to get rid of this man because this man tried to switch up on her. She want to come over there and deal with you and get with you in a relationship, right? Try to tempt you and all that shit like that to make this man mad because that's what they do. They fight each other. They leave each other fuck. Come, well, they leave each other fight, have sex, and then, you know, that whole little karmic cycle over and over and over. So now this person want to rush towards you and lay with you. Like I said, to be karmic and just pop up on this man. And she want to tell you everything that this man been doing, following you, slamming during you getting readers on you knowing that he cannot come towards you even though he got these sexual desires right and so this is going to cause a physical altercation because this masculine don't want her to come and tell you what the hell going on because he got an accurate reading on something oh an accurate reading on the fact that uh you don't care about his advances and all that shit and he refuses to believe that you don't want to let him over there so he upsets she upsets right you're going in the right direction but they wanted to stop you okay unforeseen forces these monitoring spirits possibly trying to uh find out what you're doing next in life yeah spirit of pride because this person don't want you to be out here making money if you ain't giving them no cootie or if they can't sell you to somebody else okay the occult this person is involved in the occult like i said it could have been an ex that lied and said you had a baby and you didn't have a baby by them or you could have a full-blown child by this person and this person is just psycho yeah, he don't want you to have love and happiness. He want to fight with you. He wants to argue with you. He don't like the fact that whenever you left him alone, you didn't turn around to give a damn, okay? And he also don't like the fact that somebody out here about to love on you. You got a lot of big ventures and opportunities going on because you look good, okay? Spirit of lust, he's so upset that he cannot come and say, yeah, I'm still sleeping with her too, all right? So if he can't sleep with you, then this woman can't sleep with you, but this woman want to try to come sleep with you first. This is, this is nothing that you want anything to do with. You got a whole marriage and stability and resources elsewhere. It's just these people's sexual desires that keep popping back up in your energy. And you're spiritually protected from whatever physical altercation that they want to have. But see, this physical altercation is coming from some sort of candle work that they had done. Maybe possibly to cause them some chaos. Damn. Chaos with a sneaky link to bring an end to something. Oh, okay, so this man wanted this woman to come and fight you and beat your ass, and instead of her wanting to beat your ass because he wanted to go over there with her, she wanted to sleep with you. She's attracted to you. So now they're whooping each other asses because... Bruh. So now they're whooping each other asses because both of them want to come be with you, and they're jealous of each other's attraction to you. <laughs> Why would you want to be karmic? Do y'all be hearing the shit that these folks be going through? Ain't gang if you let shit slide. Okay, so they might be boosting each other up. <laughs> what yeah encouraging each other to come in battle encouraging each other to keep going okay so they be arguing about you right and one of them might say something i don't know they be arguing about you and it just end up with she ain't ever gonna want you no motherfucking way she'll be with me before she be with your ass she don't even like girls fuck is you talking about or why would she want to be with you blah 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 you know what I'm saying? Like, you ain't got this going for yourself. You ain't got that going for yourself. And then one of them had the nerve to say, oh, you got that shit. And the other one was like, I got from you. And then y'all, they was doing all kind of stuff. Somebody knew your birthday. So this is definitely an ex or a sneaky link that possibly got you something for your birthday one time. Or at least you brought up your birthday around a sneaky link. And his sorry ass probably ain't get you nothing. <laughs> yeah. They got a birth chart reading and found out that you are the divine being, which really made this masculine feel some sort of way. Because he was like, what the fuck? Do you, you mean I had a sneaky link with a divine being and I didn't even fucking know it? You know how much money I can make with her, off her? Like, this man lost his mind. So it really makes him mad that you're a divine being and you're getting better and better because you're doing your self-care. <laughs> you look super good, okay? You got this man and this woman out here tripping. You got men. What I say? You got men and women out here conflicted, Okay natural healing knowledge is gonna make you wealthy okay so whether you are good with herbs or whether you just good with dealing with emotional situations and growing and learning that's going to help you be wealthy it's possibly helping you now uh the more you heal yourself the more wealth that you bring towards yourself okay health is wealth and so that's what's helping you yeah wealthy divine being and self-care health is wealth that's what's helping you these people in the background with the spirit of lust they possibly are conflicted about some sort of gun violence maybe you have a gun and they're uh, afraid to come towards you maybe they tried to send a physical altercation to you and the reader was a liar because whatever was supposed to happen didn't happen they did an animal sacrifice possibly for some gun violence to happen to you uh so that this masculine can come and save you all right so this masculine could have possibly tried to get you kidnapped could have possibly tried to get you robbed and hurt whatever it was just so that he can come around and pretend like he saved you so that you would let him back in your energy because you know you've been he been hexing the hell out of you and you don't want to be around him okay another car hit the floor i'm so sick of this i'm gonna have to spoon up close to the table but hold on y'all let me get it it was this car. He did not want you in alignment. 
with the romance, friends, family ties, nothing. He wanted you desolate and by yourself so that he would be the one to have to come and save you. So he decided to add in this third party uh, magic to entice a situation. But some of y'all, he was committed to trying to cause some gun violence. He possibly had some people uh, that he told some bullshit to. He slandered uh, uh, you to these people and told these people that he wanted to get you robbed and that they needed to rob you and steal something from you. Um, yeah. Maybe some people that you thought were supporting you in the community. Um, these people turned against you when you started doing whatever it was new that you were doing, but your ancestors guided you to get away from this individual. Um, he has a spirit of greed. Dang, this lady was really mad with you because you didn't like her, bro. She was sleeping with this man on the side. To be honest, y'all, I just had it like public image is very important to this mask and that he poison that's how he gives to people he could possibly put stuff in people's drinks or just the shit he say is conflicted the poison the, the stuff he say out his mouth he's a lazy ass person that tries to pretend like he's not because he was trying to use you in order to boost his public image okay that started the verbal altercations between him and his feminine. But I'm going to be honest with you. I really don't feel like, yeah, he was trying to get initiated in this occult as well. Possibly trying to use you as a sacrifice. Now he depressed because he can't get in the occult to make no money and use you. And he stuck with her. And he want to come over there with you. It's all kind of bullshit. Spirit of envy. He still envy you. He still jealous as all hell because he couldn't be wealthy and get what he wanted. Um... He don't want me to say what I was trying to say because he keeps stopping me. Oh, yeah, that's why. Because this ain't his wife. It's conflicting energies. He got a wife, but this one that wanted to come sleep with you and be in this third party and this dizzy-ass girl, she ain't nobody motherfucking wife. She a side bitch. I'm sorry. She's a side feminine. He be pimping her off to his homeboys. He'll sleep with her or tell people that he slept with her and then go tell them and then they'll give him money to talk to her. Y'all, that's what he was doing. He wanted to do that with you, but he was upset that you wouldn't let it happen. You was getting your own money your own type of way and wasn't studying him. This man got a whole wife at home, bro, and it's not this girl. This man got a whole wife at home. Messages, changes, you change your vibe. Maybe they thought that, you know, you was going to get into it with them and it didn't work. You healed. You changed your vibe. You're not in a lower vibration. You're not going to let something like that piss you off. So what I'm getting is that this man could have wanted to deal with you. You didn't want to deal with him or you stopped dealing with him, right? Because he possibly was dealing with too many people or you found out he had a wife. Either way it go. <clears throat> He was still telling these feminine that he had on the side, especially this feminine, who was a little iffy about you, that he was sleeping with you. She seen a picture of you, and she was like, I think she's very pretty. I want to be with her. And he was like, that bitch ain't going to want you. That bitch don't like nobody. She said, you a hoe, you a slut, you this, you that. And the girl built up some sort of malice, and she was like, well, I don't know why. I'm just going to go try to be her friend on my own. And she found out that this man was jealous on some other shit because you ain't want to be with him. So then that's when the feud started, and they was like, nah, we're going to fight over her. Look at this shit. And I really feel like the only reason, too, not only because you don't want to pay no mind to her, uh, this being that she got, this energy that wants to come to you, not only that you don't want to pay no mind to her, but I think it also upset her that uh, this person actually wanted to support you. And she'd been sleeping and fucking on him for a long time, and he never really gave her a position of, you know, a position. I don't know. Maybe this person had a business and you were actually working in his business. He could have been pipping holes in the background. I don't know. But she's upset that she never actually got a position of support or comfort from him. And he used to give you that. But I think he only gave you that because he knew better. Like he had to kiss your ass. The car said it will be some jail time going on because of some of the stuff they had going on. So I, I pretty much figured that he was trying to get initiated and get you kidnapped and get you hurt and all that stuff like that. Um, sacred geometry and an herbal remedy. You possibly need like a spiritual bath. Because this person is trying to reach you in your dreams. They're a liar. Wow. They're a liar. They want to come lie to you and try to get back in your energy. Most definitely heavy on the STD. You're protected from these scammers. So there's nothing you need to worry about. You just need to hear about how they fight behind you in the background. Yeah. All right. I think that's it. This is it. This is all, my love. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here with this one and clean the table off and get into the next one.